Back in March, I made a video asking for help in finding new wheels for my 2019 STI. I like the wheels that come with the car, but their design makes it very difficult to clean them, and I wanted to go to an 18-inch wheel and get a tire that would allow for more sidewall area to soften the ride. As you can see here, the wheel has many spokes, and removing brake dust from every one of them is a process to say the least. Also, the brake caliper is very close to the spokes, and you can't get a sponge between them, which just adds to the frustration of getting them clean. After looking into the suggestions that were left in the comments section of my video and looking at different wheels on and off for several months, I finally decided on these wheels from Titan 7. They are their TS5 forged 18 by 9.5 inch wheel with a satin titanium finish. And here's some video of me unboxing one for the first time. They look great and they only weigh 18.3 pounds each. Very light. So. I almost went with a black wheel, but decided instead to go with a color that better matched the car's silver color and would brighten the look of the car overall. And after seeing them for the first time, I was not disappointed with my decision. And now I'll show you what I got with the wheels. First are the hub rings. For an extra charge, Titan 7 offers these very lightweight lug nuts. They are really nice and they feel like they weigh nothing at all. Next are the Titan 7 center caps. They are $100 for the set of four. I know it sounds like a lot to spend on center caps, but with such a nice set of forged wheels, I didn't want to cut corners. And you can see here, they have the T7 logo on the center cap. When you are putting these on your wheels, you do not use a mallet, you will break them. You push them on with your hands. Back in the box they go until it's time to install them. Last thing to show you are these valve stems that come with the wheels. They are really nice. And they have the T7 logo on the valve cap. And here's what everything looks like together. Now it's time to see if I can fit all the wheels in the car without taking them out of their boxes. And I'll speed up the process for you. I'll start by putting the back seats down. I love how flat they are when they're down. I was able to fit three boxes in the car, 
two on the back seats, but only one fit in the trunk. I tried to fit the last box above one of the boxes on the back seats, but that wouldn't work. And I put it in the trunk, but I knew that wasn't going to fit. So the front passenger seat was the only spot left, and I'm going to have to make it work. So I'll slide the passenger seat as far back as I can get it. If I slid that box further back towards the trunk, it wouldn't even have been close to the back of the seat. Before I put a box on my passenger seat, I'll cover it with a moving blanket to protect it. and it fit with no problem at all. Now all four boxes are in the car. I love how much room there is in this trunk. And this final box has all the accessories for the wheels. Here you can see that the box in the passenger seat in no way interferes with my stick shift. I love you, STI. In the next video, I will show you the whole tire installation process. What tires do you think I bought? Let me know in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, let me know by giving it a thumbs up. And be sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification to know when new car story videos are posted. Until then, thanks for watching. Goodbye for now.